Bristol Community College, Mathematics with Dan Avedikian, Math 060, Topics in Developmental Mathematics, Section 3.5, Problem 24. This is Section 3.5, Problem Number 24. It says use the correct order of operations to complete the problem, and we have 36.8 minus 31.9 over 1.4. So for order of operations, if you have parentheses, you must do the work in parentheses first. I don't see parentheses, but actually that fraction bar is like parentheses. It's what they call a type of grouping symbol. You have to complete the work above the fraction bar first. So let's do that subtraction. I can write it out underneath here. 36.8 minus 31.9. So we want the decimals to line up. They do. If they didn't, we would have to make them line up. So to start off with, 8 minus 9, 8 is not big enough, so I'll have to borrow. So go over one spot to the 6, reduce it to a 5. That 8 cannot be written as an 18. 18 minus 9 is 9. The next column over, 5 minus 1 is 4. Then the last column is just 3 minus 3. Those cancel off. Keep your decimal in line. It's going to come straight down, so it's 4.9. So that fraction is now... 4.9 over 1.4. Well, when you have a fraction, it's, this is really like a type of division. What we're saying is 4.9 divided by 1.4. So with a calculator, we could enter it this way. But really, to do it by hand, you have to put the 4.9 under a division symbol and the other number, 1.4, in front of the division symbol. Now. To start this division, I can't have the decimal between the 1 and the 4 and the 1.4. I have to move it as far to the right as it'll go. So, which means moving it one spot to the right to take it all the way to the right. Well, however many positions I move it for the number in front of the division symbol, I have to move it the same number of positions for the number under the division symbol. So, one spot for both. So the problem now really is written 14 divides into 49. Now I can go ahead and do that problem. So 14 divides into 4, it, it won't go. 4 is not big enough. 14 into 49. Um, 3 will get me pretty close. So let's do 3 times 4 is 12. Um, right to 2 carry the 1, 3 times 1 is 3, 3 plus 1 more is 4. So that is pretty close. So 49 minus 42 is 7. Now, it didn't go in evenly, and I'm really all the way to the end of the digits in the number under the di division symbol. So what you do now is you can put a decimal and put a zero after it. That zero is there. We just don't usually bother to write it. So now I have a digit to bring straight down. So 70. So 14, 5 should actually make it work. So 4 times, 5 times 4 is 20. Write the 0, carry the 2. 5 times 1 is 5. 5 and 2 more is 70. So it does go in evenly. Now notice the way this answer is written out, it looks like it says 35. But really, that decimal has to come straight up from what's written in the number under the division symbol. So the answer is not 35. It's 3.5. So that whole original problem, doing the order of operations correctly, will give you a result of 3.5.